Hello and welcome to my quick Canva slideshow transitions video where I'm going to be showing you how to add transitions. Let's get right on into it. And of course, if you want to test out Canva, I will leave my link down below where you can try them for free or get easier access to log in. So why this might be so tricky is the fact that when you have your slideshow at the bottom, like if you hover over this, you can do things. What you need to do is hover in between and hold it there. And after like a half of a second, you're going to see you can add page or add transition. So what you do for the transition here is going to be done between this one and this one. So wherever you are between, that's where the transition is going to be. So let's click on it right there. Oops, as I click off, of course. Okay, so let's click add transition. There we go. So as you can see, there's going to be a few like dissolve, there's slide. And that's the cool thing. If you hover over it, it's going to show you what it looks like. Okay. We have match and move. That one's not bad. Flow. That one's not bad either. I kind of like that one, given the fact that the background stays and then changes out. We have stack, we have chop. Let's go with flow there. Perfect. And we can do, you know, apply between all pages if you want. Uh, if you want to make your life easier, you can definitely do that. But I think that one looks good. Let's go here where it's different. So we have this one and we have this one, both kind of similar, just with some, you know, different text and different images. So let's hover in between. Let's do add transition and let's check it out. Let's see how it looks. I really like that when you hover over it. This one's actually not that bad. You know, picture there, then the other picture shows up. It kind of like flip flops, right? That one has some color to it. Okay, that one's not bad. Just kind of going over them again. That one actually, did I use flow before? Because I think that one works great there just as well. And let's say we want to do one more. I'll do it a little bit different. So transition, how about chop? Why not? Okay, and that's going to be it. So let's click on duration here and uh, thank you so much for watching this tutorial. If you have any questions, feel free to leave a comment down below and I'm just going to end it showcasing what the slideshow looks like. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy.